Now we will see associative arrays in PHP. If you did not see the previous video, what is array and index arrays, you please watch that video. Link will be provided in the description. Now we will see associative arrays use named keys that can be used to reference that element value, which is nothing but here. In the associative array, it uses key value pair. Okay, key double arrow value it will use. So here how to use associative arrays means for example if any person's age I want to store by using associative arrays. So here dollar array name person's age I want to store. So here for example age I am taking dollar age is equal to array function key value pair you need to take for example ram okay ram double arrow his age is 35 this value also you need to write in the double quotes and next for example sita her age is like some 32 next for example ravi his age is like 40 and so on okay this is nothing but a associative array okay so array name is equal to array function within the array function you need to use the key value pairs this is nothing but a key this is nothing but a value key value pairs can be having this double arrow symbol okay so here for example dollar age is equal to array within the function key value pairs you need to mention otherwise you can remember simply like this also uh, array name dollar age of key is equal to value dollar array name is equal to key is equal to value and so on also you can write any one method you can remember this is the best one so here uh, by using this i am going to be writing one small program you can write your own programs also you can take for example person's salary okay by using associative salary here you can mention the array name as a salary and ram salary is like for example 50000 sita salary is 70000 lakshman salary is 1 lakh like that also you can write any program you can write next associative array i declared next echo sita is so on the output screen sita is you will get dollar h of sita this is nothing but a key okay so dollar age of key is nothing but a what is the value having 32 so it will take the 32 value okay concatenation symbol used to dollar age of key means it will take the value so value is nothing but a 32 years for remaining also you can write echo ram is dollar concatenation dollar age of key value you need to give okay whenever you are giving key value you can use a single quote and years so here dollar age of ram ram key value is nothing but a 35 so here ram is 35 years like that you will get okay you can write your own programs also if you want otherwise you can take down this programs next we will be having the multi-dimensional arrays multi-dimensional arrays containing one or more arrays so here in the multi-dimensional arrays it contains one or more arrays this you need to remember for example in a table like for example in a table this is one table in the table i have taken car name and stock sold sold car name shift volvo i10 i have taken stock 10 out of 10 stock 5 sold out volvo out of 20 stock 7 sold out i10 out of 15 stock 9 sold out and so on this uh, i want to maintain this information by using multi-dimensional array and this uh, i want to write by using program we can store the data from the table by using the two-dimensional array so here this can be stored by using the multi-dimensional array so here array name array name is nothing but a cars information i want to store so i am using dollar array name is nothing but a cars i am using 
to represent arrays you need to use the array function so here uh, I want to store this by using multi-dimensional array so multi-dimensional array means it contains one or more arrays so here we, uh, in the array function I am declaring one more array okay for each rows you need to represent one array okay so here three array three rows are there you need to mention three arrays array of shift 10 5 like this you need to mention so for the string you need to represent in the double quotes next array of volvo 27 like this you need to mention okay each array is separated by comma next array of i10 5 comma 15 comma 9 so strings will be represented by using the double quotes this total array function is closed here with a semicolon hope you are getting this is nothing but a multi-dimensional array same thing i am representing by using the program if you want to take you can take your own table also so here write a php program by using multi-dimensional array so here i want to print the information like this on the output screen shift in stock 10 sold 5 okay this i am writing in stock sold i am writing and whatever the information shift 10 5 this information i am taking from the table as it is so here echo dollar cos of 0 0 so here in in the array how it will store this information how it will store in the form of a rows and columns if you see here by seeing here you can easily 0 1 2 okay 0 8th row 1 row second row 0 8th column 1th column okay at 0 0 what is the value you are having shift so this is total array name is cars cars of 0 0 means shift echo means printing dollar cars of 0 0 which is nothing but it will print shift okay so next i am concatenating some message in stock this is message i have taken so here in stock it will print okay next dollar cards of 0 1 dollar cards of 0 1 in the 0 1 what is the number we are having 10 so it will print that 10 okay next dollar uh, next i am printing some message concatenation you need to use okay next sold sold i message i am printing next dollar cards of 0 2 dollar cards of 0 2 means what is the uh, value you are having five like that next line i want to print for the next line then for the volvo message so here break you need to use next echo dollar cards of one zero one throw zero eight to column i am printing volvo which is nothing but a one throw zero eight to column volvo is there next in stock i am writing so it will print as it is dollar cards of one one which is nothing but a at first row first column what is the message is there 20 and so on so here this is nothing but a multi-dimensional array or you can call it as a two-dimensional array in your examination it is mandatory that you need to write the uh, program also okay if you have any doubts you please comment me and please subscribe my channel